back to my channel. So you guys, my island. I finally put up all my Christmas decor. Look at how cute. Don't mind this, this is just a coaster. And then these little candles, they're LED lights, so you don't have to worry about anything like any fires or anything like that. So I got those at Hobby Lobby, I got three. And then this garland is from Home Goods. No, not Home Goods. This is from Hobby Lobby. And then these little, this little deer, hold on, let me go to the other side. You can see it better like this. This little deer is from Target for a dollar. This tree right here is from Target. And then this little globe is from, how cute is this? From Home Goods? Yeah, Home Goods. And it even plays music if you wind it, but I didn't get it for that. I just got it for the, just the look of it. And then this um, table runner is from Home Goods. And yeah, oh, and the little tray is also from Home Goods. I got all of that at the same time. So what it looks like, and then on this corner I have another one of those light up candles, and then these three little trees, also from Target. And then I got this little thing base from Hobby Lobby, which I've had forever, but I bought the like cranberry leaves from Target to just put in there, kind of gave like more Christmassy vibe. I have this little tree in here. That's from, um, where did I get that at? Target also. So yeah, let's go do some retail therapy. Okay, so I walked outside and it was like a little chilly. So now I'm gonna change into something a little bit more cozy because I just have on a t-shirt and I know that depending on where I go, the shopping center I go to, I'm gonna be walking outside and I don't wanna be cold. So let's change into a sweater. Okay, so I ended up changing my whole freaking outfit. Kind of knew that was going to happen. I have on this Skims top with, I don't know if you can see my bralette underneath. You probably can, but whatever. I put this sweater over it from Urban Outfitters with Lululemon leggings. Throw on my tennis shoes and then we're out. I'm looking a little, a little dry. Hold on. A little lip gloss ASMR. Hey y'all, no, I am, ooh, ignore those boxes, those need to go to the trash, I just haven't had time, I, <clears throat> I'm in the store, so I have a TJ Maxx, and a Ross, TJ Maxx and Ross haul. I got back in and so my face is a little oily. Oh well, it's been on, this makeup has been on since I left when I saw you guys earlier, which was a couple hours ago. So I was doing a little bit of running around. Remember I told you guys I didn't know where I was gonna go, but I needed to get out the house because I just needed to get out the house. So I ended up going, spending a little bit of coin um, so I went to TJ Maxx, Ross, and that was it. I was going to go to Target, but I was like so tired. It's literally 10.30 already, plus they closed our, they were probably already going to be closed by the time I got there anyway. So, so the first thing I got was I needed um, a, new, a new candle. I needed a new freaking candle. So I ended up getting this one here and I got, like going to TJ Maxx to get their candles because they're humongous and it was and they're like so inexpensive. This, this one was $12.99 and I think um, Hobby Lobby, not Hobby Lobby, Bath and Body Works is having their candle sale right now so and it ends tomorrow so I may still even end up going and spending $10 on one half like half the size of this candle just because I like their scents but um, this one was, this is a Northern Pine candle, three-way candle. 
Oh my god, it literally, I got it because it was like Christmas and I'm kind of in the Christmassy mood if you can tell. Um, so yeah, I got this to put here um, and I'll like that as soon as this video is done. The next thing I got was wrapping paper because I didn't have wrapping paper and obviously it's Christmas time. Why is my stand moving like that? Maybe because the air turned on? I don't know, but hopefully it's not wobbly. There is something on my lens, whatever. Is it good? Are we good? I think we're good. So this, um, I ended up picking up two wrapping, different wrapping papers and I kind of wanted to get into the like red, more festive themes, colors for the year, for the new Christmas year, as I have neutral colors laying here. But I mean like, or to go under my tree, I want to have like, since my tree's gonna be green, I want to have like reds, silvers, and golds kind of incorporated into it. I still haven't built my tree, I'm gonna vlog that, so it's in my car, I just haven't, I just haven't taken it out. Um, anyways, this one's just like a pine tree uh, wrapping paper with white, and then this is just like a, kind of like a, what do you call this, candy cane pattern, red and white, and they're both, they were both $3.99, so I'm like, um, yes, I picked up two because I know I'm going to need tons of wrapping paper. The big bag, the big body over here. Some tape, obviously, to wrap um, the gifts, to tape them up or whatever. And this was $2.99. And then I went to Ross and I saw a packet with um, three, things of, three things of tape, some scissors, and like the whole kit pretty much for $2.99. I'm like, I should have just gone, I should have just waited and got it at Ross, but whatever. I have scissors here, it doesn't matter. I had already bought it, so whatever. Three things of tape, because I didn't have any. Um, and then I got, woo, I got some hair clips, because I have this little baby one in my hair right now. I don't know if you guys can tell this little thing right here. That, I don't know how my hair is staying up, because I have very thick hair. Maybe it's because I blow dried my hair and it's a little bit thinner than like my natural state hair. Um, but I've been having to work with this little baby clip because my other one's broke. Um, and so this, I got a pack of four and I just thought the brown was something neutral, you know. I don't really have to worry about if it matches my outfit or whatever. It would just blend in with my hair a little bit. And this was $7.99 for four, which I think that's really good. And then I picked up some hair. Oh, I'm just dropping everything. <sighs> Jesus, I'm, I'm kind of annoyed that you guys can see those boxes back there, but bear with me, okay? Then I also got some hair setting clips. Just a pack of eight. And these were $5.49, which I feel like it's kind of like a lot for just the eight pack, but I don't know, I probably could have bought them on Amazon for cheaper, but it's, I guess we're paying for convenience. Totally forgot I got these, but I got these little like um, kitchen towels, so that way I can put like in front of my oven, uh, in front of my dishwasher, just to get a little bit more festive up in here. And um, I thought these were super cute with the neutral colors. And it has a, so a pine tree one, and then like a green color striped one and like a plaid one so i got this is a pack of three and this was 7.99 which i think i think that's pretty good for a pack of three so i'm going to put those on in a little bit i had to pick up a white elephant gift for work um and i ended up seeing they actually have a lot of really cute like grab and go gifts under 20 dollars which was the limit 20 dollars and i just picked up this cute like set it, I'm like, I would want that. I would definitely steal that from somebody. But um, if you know about the white elephant game, pretty much, I'm not going to go into too much detail, but you pretty much steal gifts after they're all open. Just short explanation for it. Um, long story short, <laughs> uh, this is the Spa Day Collection. It comes with an adjustable towel wrap, a Terry Spa headband, and cozy slippers. So those are the slippers, the little headband that's like, I always see girls on TikTok doing their makeup with this little headband. I'm like, why does 
so cute and then the little hair towel thing that i mean who doesn't need a hair towel you know so this is what i got for the girls whoever whoever ends up getting it very lucky i mean i may even steal it back but hey it was $16.99 so i was way under i'm well, not way under budget but i was under budget $20 was the budget and i think that this is gonna be fun i hope they fight for it no <laughs> they better fight for it so that's all i got at tj i ended up spending 67 dollars there which i think is reasonable for all the stuff i got anyways let's move on to ross gosh you guys are gonna die at what i found at ross and I spent $50 there. First things that I found were these super duper cute juicy like slides, house slippers. And I just loved the detail on them. And I like that they're black too because um, they just, you know, they, they'll, they won't get that dirty as fast or whatever. And I wear my slippers too like till they're like about to fall off the, the back or whatever the soles originally i guess 20 dollars, but they were 11.99 at ross so y'all need to go check out your local ross because these are so cute so cute thing y'all oh my god i was so shocked that i found this this set i found a juicy sleepwear set and i just could not resist look at it so this it's very like understated which i love like i don't want you to know that i'm wearing juicy pretty much um like from far away you can't even tell that it says juicy but when you get closer look at the detail it literally says juicy all over it and it's silk with that silky material so it's gonna be super comfy to sleep in and then these are the bottoms the pants they also say juicy like Ooh, hopefully y'all can see it but er, like it's just and then they're like the wide leg and this set was i think this is one of the most expensive things i got at ross i think yeah it was um 17.99 apparently the retail is 54 girl bye next set that i picked up oh my gosh are you guys ready for this one is this sleepwear set and it has the juicy couture logo right there i mean how freaking cute and then the back has like the juicy all in like that pretty um what is that i don't know what you call those little rhinestones girl and then the pants are just the same color the same print um the only little detail that these have are on the top which i like i don't like it having too much going on like all if it would have had juicy on the butt i probably would have not gotten gotten him just because i just feel like it's too much i like that the shirt has it instead of the bottom and then this is the little rhinestone on the pants so yeah and that was literally this one was $16.99 so a dollar less than the other one but i swear if they had this in black or white i would have picked them both up all three of them up. i think i hit the jackpot but if you have a ross near you and i'm sure you do grab those car keys or grab that uber or grab your mom's car or whoever and go to ross to go look and find these because i don't think that these are going to be there for much long there was like not many left but I mean, and these are also perfect holiday gifts too, so. So, yeah, guys, that will wrap up my little haul for today. I am about to call it a night, turn my candle, wash this makeup off, clean up a little bit. I also want to say I'm going to attempt, I'm going to try my best to vlog throughout December. I'm not doing vlogmas. I wouldn't call it vlogmas because I think vlogmas is like you vlog every single day and post every single day but i just i just don't think i am made for that just yet so i'm gonna roll out some more videos this month and i hope you guys enjoyed this one and let me know what you guys want to see more of and i will see y'all on my next one peace out girl scout <laughs>
come for ho what am I saying? Ho 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 ho. Roll your boat. <laughs> I guess ho ho ho. Merry Christmas.